Fluffy Pants here. Today I got another collection video. And since Black Panther's coming out this weekend, um, it, I mean, it depends whenever you're watching this, but I decided I'd do my Marvel movie collection and, like, give you thoughts on the movies I got. I already did um, my two Blu-rays. I'm not going to do a separate video for all these DVDs right here. Um, but um, I'll go ahead and give you my thoughts in this video. But first up, um, my two Blu-rays I got in my Marvel Cinematic Universe collection. Um, I already did a review on this. You can go check those out. But in case you didn't see those, I got Spider-Man Homecoming. Love this movie. Best Spider-Man in my opinion. So you got Spider-Man and Iron Man right there. Great movie. I wish I had the slip cover on it, but love that movie. And then right here we have Guardians of the Galaxy Volume 2, which is in my top five favorite Marvel movies. I love this movie so much. See, I got that nice holographic iridescent slip cover. Um, Guardians of the Galaxy Volume 2. Got this like the first week it came out. I got Spider-Man Homecoming for Christmas, but yep. Um, the deleted scenes, I really like deleted scenes on this one. Awesome movie. I, I like it better than the first one. Okay, and then my DVDs, which I only have three of, because I don't really buy DVDs anymore. Unless, like, they don't have a Blu-ray with it, like Christmas of the Cranks. Um, they haven't made a Blu-ray of that yet, but first, okay, so, um, my first DVD is Captain America Civil War. Um, great Captain America movie. It's a vent, a lot of people say it's Avengers 2.5, and I definitely agree with that. Superhero, the Superhero Airport Battle is awesome in it. There's the back. I need to get the Blu-ray for all these Marvel movies I got on DVD. You can see a nice cool front. Um, that's probably my favorite Captain America movie. I oh, don't know, Winter Soldier was pretty good too. Okay, and then next up we have Avengers 2 Age of Ultron. I love this movie. I actually do enjoy it better than the first one. And I saw this when it first came out. And I still stick by my opinion that I, I enjoy watching it better than the first one. I don't know. I guess, uh, in my opinion, a lot of people let the nostalgic of the first one play into what they think of the movie. I mean, I didn't see the first one in theaters, but, um, I don't know. I, I, I mean, it was kind of boring, and it, it didn't really have a lot of great action in it, in my opinion. I mean, some parts of it were cool, but this one I absolutely love. I love the, um... The part in the movie whenever Sokovia is floating up and um, they have the helicarrier come out. That was just an awesome scene. Hulk Buster's awesome in this. Love Iron Man and Ultron in it. Need to upgrade that one to Blu-ray too. Then last up is another one of my favorite Marvel movies, which is in my top five, which is Ant-Man. Um, I love this movie. Can't wait for the new, new one, Ant-Man and the Wasp. The trailer for that was awesome. This movie was awesome. Ant-Man is inside Civil War, but, um, Ant-Man's probably one of my favorite heroes. You see right there, you got in the back Yellow Jacket, which I actually did think Yellow Jacket was a pretty good villain. Um, and I like the old, like, suit he wears in this one, um, more than the Civil War version. Um, I don't know, I just really like how this looks, the kind of faded red. It just looks really cool, and the helmet's awesome. And then, um, Michael Pena, I think that's his name, um, all the way down there, he was great in this movie, and, um, I think Michael Douglas, and of course, um, um, gosh, what's his name, Paul Rudd, he was awesome in it, but guys, that's pretty much all the Marvel movies I own, I do need to get a couple more, um, I'm, I'm gonna get Thor Ragnarok whenever that comes out on Blu-ray, might get that, I'm probably gonna get that the first week. It comes out. Um, I like the slip cover on it. It's really cool where it's like the um, Gladiator one. The still book for that one, I, I don't really like it. I haven't, I don't got a still book yet, but I definitely want to get one. Um, but that one's just kind of boring to me. But that's just my Marvel Cinematic Universe collection. Um, but I like, thank you guys for watching. Check out some of my other videos. Um, and if you're interested, check out my two blue Marvel Blu-rays um, unboxings and reviews. And I'll see you guys later. Bye.